We, we should be good. Welcome to the weekend, everybody. Yep, it's a GBC game, Game Boy Color. I'm playing it on true Game Boy Color. Um, yep, truly on the Game Boy Color. It's the wiki end, yeah. Put me on Wikipedia. I have a feeling this is gonna be super short. So we got, is this Mr. Soap? Shovel and Pail, I think that's what they're called. Is this Salt and Pepper, pep, pep, Paprika? The, the drawer, uh, I don't know the bear's name. And then there's Blue. Let's start with Blue. Select a page. What's our favorite letter? Uh, I wanna do G for Griffin. Is Steve? Where are all the pages? Let's play Blue's Clues. Is this P? No. Oh, I don't like the soap. Bubble blowing up. Which one was this? I've already forgotten. No, that was not it. The Z. Oh, rip. I guess there's, like, there must be 26 different versions of the Blue's Clues game in one, and you can just also play the mini games, I think. <gasps> I see a clue! Do you see a clue? How do I get to said clue? Let's write it in our handy dandy notebook. Every <laughs> Good one, Nogi. I have some vague memories that, yeah, this sounds exactly like it. So, the point of Blue's Clues is, well, this is, I guess, Blue's Clues classic, like, the first season, or, like, the first series. This is our friend Steve. He's played by Steve Burns, um, who is now a musician and actor. Um, if here's here's the thing, I always talk about this any chance I get to talk about uh, Steve Burns. Yes, he was in Blue's Clues, but he was he's a musician, and you can get his it's Songs for Dust Mites. I think I thoroughly enjoy it. Songs for Dust Mites. Yeah, it's it's a great album. Um, thoroughly enjoyed it. No, he didn't die. He didn't want to go bald on TV. Anyway. There we go. But Steve lives with Blue. And I guess he's in high school because he says that he has to go to college before he left the show. But he and his friend, his friend Blue, they live in this house. And he's going to help solve Blue's problems or the mysteries. Yeah, he said he didn't want to go bald on children's television. And, like, he didn't intend to be on children's TV for forever. But apparently it was he didn't want to go bald on TV. What? What's happening here? Which, I mean, I, I, mean, I, get, the, I get that sentiment. The animations for this is pretty fun and cute. I do like the music too. Like I'm in, like this is a cute little kids game. But you know, you go around Blue's house or outside or different places and like, ooh, like Blue, what do you want to do today? And Blue will leave clues around everywhere. Bot. Oh, it spells boat. <gasps> And Blue will leave clues for the things that she wants to do that day. So look, like there's a clue on the table. Do you see Blue's clue? Do you see a clue? Where? Right there. 
Let's write it in our handy dandy notebook. That's a table. Yeah, the clouds, they were they were themed like that. Look pretty good. And I guess we have, and normally, you know, there's like mail time or they do something else. You know, everyone knows the mail song. Here's the mail, it never fails. It makes me wanna wag my tail. When it hollers, makes me right? When it comes I wanna wail mail E. Where's an A? A. T. Mm-hmm. <gasps> Do you see a clue? Well, not Steve doesn't, but Blue does. We all have a tailbone. It's time for the thinking chair. The thinking chair. Will you help me? It's time to think. 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 Because when we use our mind and take a step at a time, we can do anything that we want to do. That's very cute. We just got this is the we just got a letter song. Glasses, hanger, inchworm, and juice. I like the inchworm. He looks great. Hello. Where are all the pages? I don't know what he's saying. Let's play blues clues. Oh, I'm playing it again. <laughs> Here are the peaches. <laughs> oh, where are the pages? Now we're learning the notes through shitty GBA sound card. <laughs> Oh, we found G, G through J. Got it. <gasps> Look, there's a clue. Uh, Let's write it in our handy dandy notebook. It's a pillow. Who is this bear? Oh, we gotta catch the leaves. Okay. I think she does. She just, I think Blue just has a stamper that she can press put her paw on. No, I don't remember the bear. I'm not really sure who this is. Was it a story bear? Like it was a storybook maybe? Remember, I'm a grown adult. I don't remember. They live in the book. We found a clue. In our handy dandy notebook. What is that? Pajamas. Read book. <laughs> oh, a tomato, a pea, a banana. There was a live action thing, right? Oh, look at that pizza. Love it. What is this? Like a mango? What is that? This looks like a fossilized piece of pizza. <laughs> oh, an orange, maybe. That's a pea. That's a lemon. What is this? Like a piece of pie? Oh, you think that was the pie? Maybe. Alright, that's a lemon. Oh, I love the animations from Mr. Salt and Mrs. Pepper. Watch, watch them, watch them. Ready? They're really cute. 
Oh, you think it was a line? All right. Well, man, listen. I wonder where there's a clue. <laughs> what? Aren't limes start out as green? Or lemons start out as green, right? Oh, that's a clock. Let's go to the thinking chair. Kite, letter, and mailbox. Hello. Where are all the pages? Let's play. Blues I still don't know what they're saying. Oh man, what is this gonna spell? P. A. N. Pan. No! Nap. We could all go for a nap. There's a clue. What is that? Oh, it's a sink. <laughs> oh, it's getting complicated. Dune! Where's Alicia? So she can talk about Timothy. Running back and forth. <laughs> Absolutely. It's a duck. No, oh, it's the music. G C A. Game Boy Color Advanced. It's a clue. In our handy dandy notebook. It's time for the thinking chair. Will you help me? What do you think we're gonna do? Think we're gonna take a bath? You are so smart. I don't know what he said. <laughs> it does not come all across very clear. A notebook, an orange, and a pillow. Nope. Hello. Where are all the pages? Mmm. Oh, it's the soap one. There's so many. I. Yo, let's go. V J. Oof. R. VJRC, VJRC, VJCR, VJCR, VJLCR.
Alright, so we know how to beat this game. We just have to go through all the letters. Do you think X is going to be for a xylophone? It's a bubble. I, they, I think they do in gr groups of... Um, groups of three or four. It spells facts! Just the facts, ma'am. Seems a lot. Jeez, I did not expect this. What do you want these leaves for? Oh! A little fast. It's a clue. Ah, uh, he wants a compost, that's fair. A basket. A bubble, a basket. Now what? What is that? Oh. Read book. I would love to read book. P. TPL. Thomas Pro Librarian. Okay, that's a pretzel. It looked like a screaming face, but... Pretzel looks like a screaming face. Haunted pretzel, absolutely. That's a cookie. We got this. Oh no. <laughs> I mean, it's a little educational. This works well with <laughs> very smart. <laughs> This works very well for edutainment month, but you know, it's teaching kids, you know, shapes and stuff, and letters, matching. There's not too much here, but, yeah, it's just a licensed game. I like the music, though. Let's write it in our handy dandy notebook. I like the music. Um, I think we're gonna do laundry. You are so smart. So, oh, it is you are so smart. We oh the song is we will we are gonna play blues clues because it's very fun. Q R and S T U N V. WXYZ. It's probably WXYZ is going to be on the same page. Jeez. FBDG. Or FDBG.
What is it? It's a chest. Oh, it's this game. Look how complicated this maze is. Oh my goodness. I wonder what this spells. The animation for them is pretty great. It's a paddle ball. Read book. Fossilized. Ooh, there's five now. Fossilized pizza. Another B. Look at that. Oh, B could be. What is that? That's not. That can't be an orange. Is it orange? Poof. Oh, that's an O. That's a lemon or a lime. I'm colorblind, so I don't know. <laughs> oh my god, that's incredible to get. <laughs> they, they, they married themselves. That's wild. <laughs> That's beautiful. I love it. <laughs> the fact that you found this out is wild. <laughs> Who are these people? Oh, nice Andy emote. Which one is this? Oh, Indie Pride, that's cute. You are so smart. Oh, we wanna play. I love the cow. Look at the cow over here. And a yo yo. Utensils is an interesting one. Thought it was a zebra. Oh, maybe it was. A zebra cow, I don't know. One or the other. <gasps> A soup! <laughs> They're both horses, yep. Bowl. Food. Can I find the D? <laughs> Woo! Oh, what is this? Let's write it in our handy dandy notebook. Corn.
Sometimes you can't find the D, and that's okay. There's the D. <laughs> I heard a great song today. Um, by Wet Legs. I had not heard of them before today. And they have a song called Chase Lounge. And they said, I went, it's, I went to school and got a degree. I got the big D. Got the big D. It's really good. It's very catchy. It's Blue's Clues. We're solving Blue's Clues. It's a, this, this is a cute little kid's game. Like... This is definitely a, a, a higher quality children's game than I expected it to be. Mm. A clue, a clue. Let's write it in our handy dandy notebook. It's a tree. I'm gonna bump the volume just a bunch. I'm gonna put it there. So you get nice loud. Oh no, there's so many. B. P. B P O. B P O X. B P O X Y. What? Come on. Fine. How about there? I miss what this letter was. B P O X Y something. A. X. P, B, P. B, P, O. K. B. It's not roll around. seen J yet. We've seen Y. Uh, K was here. I've forgotten the letters further down. A is here. Is his name Slippery Slope? <laughs> Soap? <laughs> Uh, I cannot remember where Jay was. No. No. That's fine. I don't like that he's blowing a soap bubble out of his mouth. Like, I get that he is soap, but that encourages children to also try this. Rather than bubble gum. Where's a clue? Are we gonna plant in our garden? Look at that bucket. <laughs> it's time for the thinking chair. What do you think it is? Corn, a tree, and a bucket. You are so smart. Are we gardening? The inchworm. <laughs> oh, poor pail. Washer, xylophone, yo-yo. It is a zebra stock cow. Incredible. All right, we did through G. We got to do A, B, C. We got two more to do, and then we can call this game done. <laughs> That's not a zebra. Read book. It's a zow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gross. I don't know why I dislike that so much. Oh dear. Chocolate Zilk. Mm. 
delicious. That's an A. I don't know what that is. Sabirene is here to see Blue's Clues. Oh my goodness. Welcome everyone. Sab, how are you doing, my friend? Welcome to Blue's Clues, everyone. Can, do you, can you find a clue? Where is the clue? So glad to have you here, friendo. <laughs> We're getting so much done. We're here now. Welcome to Blue's Clues, everyone. I'm Thomas. You know me as a banana, probably. But so glad that you've all decided to come here. Sab, I'm doing great. Thanks so much for raiding me. We're playing Blue's Clues as part of Mystery Month. Mystery Month is where we solve all kinds of scary things. Like, what does Blue want to do today? Do you see a clue? Notebook, let's do it. Sab, I hope you're doing well. I hope you had a great birthday the other day. It's a house! I thoroughly enjoyed watching you open Pokemon cards. <laughs> Hey, what does that spell? I'm glad you got a Charizard too. <laughs> Much to some people's chagrin. <laughs> yeah, sitting at a nice 69 viewers. Thanks everyone for achieving my dream. <laughs> I wonder what this spells. <laughs> it is a good Charizard, too. <laughs> yeah, it's worth a little bit of cash. Buy yourself a video game with it. <laughs> I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Yo, Noki, thanks so much for the 69 bits. Appreciate ya. <laughs> hey, AJ's book. Glad to have you all here hanging out, watching some Blue's Clues. It's the mailbox! Oh man, what is this spell? Pear! But we're just playing some mystery video games. We're just doing a little bit of this. Cook. I hope everybody's having a great Friday, am I right? Welcome to the weekend. Watermelon halves, I don't know. I can see the watermelon halves, absolutely. I was not an alphabet soup person. Now chicken and stars, hook me up with some chicken and stars. An alphabet watermelon? The seeds are the shit, are the bad. That's an incredible invention. That looks like a wiggly pie sign. <laughs> alphabet noodles and soup, yeah. Let's get to that thinking chair and figure this out. What could this be? Are we gonna go check the mailbox? You are so smart. We are so smart. <laughs> we'll be fine, I see. <laughs> apple, ball, and cookie. It's an apple! <laughs> it's a green apple. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> Is mailbox okay? <laughs> It is a little bit like it. Oh, 
God. Alright. S R. S R E. S R E M. S R E M. S R E M K. S R E M K Y. S R E M K Y. S. R E M K Y. Y. R E M. R E M K. R E M K Q. K. Shrek. <laughs> R E M Q. R E M Q R. E M Q. E M Q. M Q. M Q. M. Oh, baby. Did we do this per almost perfectly? Holy hell. G. You have to use some of those letters to spell the spring. <laughs> Shrek week was something. Shrek week was something. I hate this one. I don't know who this bear is. If I don't remember this bear. It's the bear from Goldilocks. I have zero memory of, memory of him ever doing Goldilocks. Goldilocks. You're right, it is unshaded. I guess because they had to animate it, so it does look a little weird. the rest of them too I guess well I guess not the body Looking for that G <laughs> of course I, I, I try to promote everyone up you know as as viewership grows we try to promote people up who have either been around or have made tremendous contribution to the T.S. John Enterprise. That'll be an emote someday. Probably not. But, you know. I want everyone to be a VIP, but I mean, you're all VIPs in my heart. But, you know. <laughs> Do you see a clue? <laughs> You know, after about a year, I'm like, yeah, you've been around for a year, and you, you stick around for a full year. The fridge! I def want, I def want to keep you around. <laughs> it does not look like Steve Birds, no. <laughs> Again, if you've not listened to Steve Burns' songs for Dust Mites, you definitely should. ABFF. ABFF, a best friend forever. You're all my ABFFs, a best friend forever. Hmm. That almost sounded good. I know it's not. I, I don't stream on a consistent schedule, so that doesn't make it any easier. Maybe. <laughs> no, they're not. It's time for the thinking chair. Can you help me? 
What do you think we're gonna do? You are so smart. Cup! <laughs> Look at that egg. <gasps> Duck! Egg! Felt friends! The felt friends! <laughs> You're right, he has not had hair in quite a while. I think we did this one, so... Did we do G? Yeah. We did them all! They should cost like a hundred dollars each. Oh, that was such a fun sound! So we did all the games. And now I think you can just do the games. I don't want to do... Oh, Jesus. I guess we did it. Eggs are complicated. They should cost like a hundred dollars each. Thank you, Noki, and thank you, Emi. We did it. We blew the clue. Secret life hack. Here's here's a great life hack for everybody. Um, when you feel like you need that you're a little bit lost and you're not sure where to go, just check your handy dandy notebook. Did you write down a to do list? Did you write down some stuff that you should be doing? Did you make a plan? Did you make your planner? Did you set out some goals for the day? Did you just write down one thing that you should do today? Maybe, maybe not. But you know, just set set a couple, set one goal to do that day. It can be as simple as drink a bottle of water, get out of bed, maybe just go for a walk. It's that easy, and you'll feel a little bit more accomplished because checking things off feels good. 